Hi and welcome to Andy's Outdoor um, Adventures. Um, I want to talk to you about a cool new piece of uh, kit which I recently purchased. Only got this in the, in the uh, mail about a day or two ago. This. This is an Austrian Army Alice pack. Holds about 45, 50 litres. The reason why I purchased this is I wanted um, a rucksack which was essentially between my 25 litre salt pack which I use for, for day hikes and my 85 modular travel type assault pack which I use for salt multi-nighters. I wanted something I could essentially take out for one or two nights I could just throw a tent in, my sleeping bag, and uh, just some other bits and pieces, just enough for one night. Or my, the other uh, thing I wanted to use it for was my kayaking trips, just something if I go out for the day, I could just throw some bits and pieces in. So what have we got? Let's take a look at this. So we've got a freight compartment, we've got two identical side compartments, we've got the main compartment. We've also got this internal um, compartment here, which I think with the internal compartment, um, you could easily probably make up some kind of frame and put it in there. It's secured by these buckles, which use like a, a push system here. All of the buckles are exactly um, the same on it. You've got two drawstrings. So you've got this drawstring here to actually seal up the bag. And you've also got the second drawstring there as well. And again, this flop, this flaps over and is secured by um, these spring buckles here. I'll just um, show you that there. Now, my opinion of this thing, I'm pretty impressed. I, I paid about 55 um, Australian dollars for this, plus about $10 in posting roughly. I'll post a link to, to the particular website I bought from a company called Army Outdoors um, in New Zealand. Now the harness, now you've obviously got the standard Harry bag. The harness, the whole thing come unissued. It was still in the original uh, um, plastic packaging when I got it. Never been used, come straight out some stalls in Salzburg or, or, or wherever in Austria. Um, so the harness is pretty simple. Again, you've got the similar sort of spring. These buckets, these buckles rather, um, you just flip that piece up. Just show you there. And then that slides, slides like that. Then, then to secure it, you simply, you um, simply push that back in there. Now I'm really happy with this. There are plenty of places you can stash the, you can stash things on. Um, there's pot points you can tie stuff on. Yeah, I think for the price, I think you can't go wrong. For just a simple sort of um, day pack really to use, uh, maybe as a big day pack for a really sort of big heavy, uh, heavier hike. Um, there's that, you've also got, oh, you know, I bought it predominantly for doing overnighters, just one or two nights, I could easily, you know, get all my stuff in there. Middle of summer, this time of year in Australia. Yeah, it's, it's not exactly cold. Um, so I'm really impressed. Um, I'll, I'll take, just take um, the, the bag uh, um, a little bit back so you can see it a little bit more, um, get a good, better picture of it. Um, so again, yeah, I'm pretty impressed. I'm going to try it the next couple of weeks and I'll give you a bit of an update uh, um, then. But definitely a, a piece of kit I would recommend. Um, Again, if you've got any questions, though, please don't hesitate to put them um, below in the in the uh, comments section, and I'll be happy to try and respond. Um, 
to as many um, uh, as you post. Uh, but otherwise, thanks for watching. Um, and you have a great weekend.